for the half of the front, we will select 40 needles. <coughs> this time I will calculate how many I have. So I have 40 needles and I'm going to cast on my yarn same way I did it for the back. I will do 40, um, sorry, 10 rows for my river, same as I did for the back. actually put my weight on my panel but instead of doing that I'm just gonna push all the needles out till I get to the row 10. So I'm at row 10 and now I'm gonna do my rubber with this tool same as I did for the back. The first one is always tricky one. Here it is.
continue picking up stitches for the pearl stitch till I finish my river. I did all of my pearl stitches for the river and uh, I should have selected 41 needles for my front, for the half of the front, only because here on this side, I need to change this needle, this last needle to a pearl stitch, but I don't want to do a side rib, side stitch in the pearl. So I'm going to keep two of these needles same way and this will go inside and it will be attached to my back. So when I'm doing the other half of the front, I'll have to keep these two needles on the other side and start from my purl stitch on second needle from this side and um, our decreases for the neckline will be on the other side of these two needles. So my neckline will be starting on the left side for this half of the front and for the other half I will be mirroring it on the right side. So I'm going to push all the needles to the front Here's beginning of my half of the front. What I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna calculate how many rows I need to start my neckline decrease. I will need to leave 25 needles for my shoulder and I will be decreasing 15 needles. So I need to calculate from which row I'm going to be starting my decreases. I did my calculations and I decided that I'm going to do my neckline decreases starting from row 36. So now I'm at row 2 and I'm going to knit to row 36 and at row 36 it's going to be my first decrease. six and I will start my decreases. I have this tool which I can use and set it to every other needle to be transferred. If you don't have tool like this just start with your third needle from the side. Transfer the third needle can push them all together and then transfer the other two needles. Don't forget that it's every other other needle you are needing. So I did my first transfer and I'm gonna do six rows. Transferring another needle. Six rows. Transfer 
and by my calculations my last transfer will be a bureau 120. I am at row 120. I'm doing my last decrease. Our back was total of 125 rows. So I'm gonna do five rows right now. One, two, three, four, five. So five rows. I'm gonna cut off my main yarn and transfer my shoulder to a waist yarn. Decreases and now I'm gonna mirror the other half same way as I did this one and just the neckline will be will be mirrored on the other side. 